we are here in the United Nations. And in the United Nations, we develop a global view of local issues. We see the whole picture of the world uh, uh, tackling those issues. And we try to really develop global policies that can be applied locally. Uh, UNCDF has identified the gap that they can fill in uh, helping the uh, local communities access global instruments that are put in place. A and this is not just uh, an easy matter. Uh, you need procedures, you need to have uh, in place, uh, I would say, uh, uh, project carriers, you need to have uh, 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 government support, uh, government uh, own action, and all that does not go without saying. And that's why we value very much such a project la like Local, who is empowering the least developed countries to be able to access the funding that uh, are available. Uh, or, or may be available uh, as a result of uh, negotiations that countries are holding at uh, a global level to put in place a uh, 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 mechanism for adaptation, for mitigation of climate change. It, the issue it does not go without saying because you need to empower them, you need to put in place uh, 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 those mechanisms, institutions that can help them uh, tap into the resources but also help them do the right thing, have the right policy at a local level. And, and I think that uh, uh, this is a very good thing if you have an instrument for that. And local is, has identified this uh, uh, niche and is trying to fill it very uh, positively. And as you know, we have uh, three levels of, uh, uh, I would say, three phases of participation in the local, of uh, uh, outcomes of the local. The first phase, phase is when uh, local uh, help institutions at local level to really uh, assess their situation, uh, to uh, make analysis and to uh, have resources to do grassroots level uh, activities that can uh, alleviate the uh, burden of the uh, population. But second phase is when this is taken to national level and spread uh, all over the country. A and third phase is when uh, the country is in a, in a, posi in a, uh, a position to really uh, access directly uh, to, to spread the, uh, uh, I would say, adaptation measures at uh, the whole uh, uh, territorial level. And we can also uh, really have more impact if we are many doing the right thing. Because first of all, uh, uh, you have at the global level a possibility to really have a clear overall and all encompassing vision of the situation. And when you act from that level, you are, uh, uh, you are sure that your impact will be uh, very focused, that you, your policy, overall policy will be coherent. If uh, what we are doing at uh, global level is not relevant, then we have a legitimacy issue. We are uh, at global level representing nations. We are here at the United Nations. And the United Nations is about we, the people. And the people has to really be in tune with what we are doing. And we have also be to be in tune with the concerns of the people so that our action be a synergic mm -hmm. one and, that it, and so that it can really generate the results that we are aiming at.